watch. Going straight into it. We're going to start on, if I had to guess, PS2. Yep, there oh, it is. Look at that. What's the surprise? And I like I like that. Hockey switching to the to the blue uh, tank top because he's player two to match. Sure. For sure. The color coordination matters a lot, man. Oh, yeah. That's... But you know what else matters a lot? Rob's up air. Super good move, and uh, Grayson going to take a lot of damage with it for really early on here. So let's see if Grayson can probably do a little bit... Uh, ooh. Because he, he, he was playing a little bit more passive than King K was. Uh -huh. So let's see if that passive playstyle uh, serves him better versus Hockey. It might be kind of hard, again, because we talked about this earlier when Hockey was fighting King K. It's really hard for Rob specifically to keep... Okay. I, I like what he tried to do there. I he see. Tr he tried to up air to defend the edge guard. He was just a little too deep for him. I was thinking he was trying to like drag down up air. And oh, no, no, no. I think he was just trying to edge guard or just try and not get edge guarded with the up air, but he's just a little low and dipped down. So regardless, it's kind of unfortunate, but mm -hmm. only 70% behind. And again, ZSS pretty light and not undoable for Grayson to take the stock here. Mm -hmm. I think it's like a solid uh, down throw to up tilt, and then the up air 50 he can catch it for sure. Yeah. Or a raw side B maybe near the ledge. I really like that. Send the gyro up just to cover himself back on uh -huh. stage. But any whiffed moves uh, ZSS does near Rob, he can, she can just F tilt or jab, both very fast moves. Her jab, yeah. in fact, frame one her jab so it's really easy for her even if she yeah. manages to whiff like a forward air or a nair she could just go yeah it's just kind of like with the get out jail yeah. free card it's like mm -hmm. oh I, I like messed up hitting this yeah. background shield okay let really me good capture that up smash hockey running away with stock two here at 154 on his first yeah. stock hockey looking in oh, what is he doing down, down there he is he is flipping around he's dude. moving a little he's bit looking like a little acrobat up tilt and that might Up be it. The suplex yeah. is going to take it. Yeah, ZSS is still pretty light. Those stocks might drop pretty early on moves with kill power like that. So we're going to have to see if Grayson can turn up some pretty low percent strings here. Otherwise, Haki might just run away with this last stock. I mean, he's looking, he's looking like pretty comfortable strings. so far. Yeah. Already at 81, almost caught the flip jump. 90. Ooh. Grayson is not letting it happen too easy, though, for sure. Cool. Nice grab. Up tilt. tilt. Up air. That's going to take That's it. That's it. Yeah, and Grayson. Good stuff to Grayson. Pretty much so even much in this in game. This. Yeah. yeah, he's so much back in this. He's not going down without a fight for certain. Definitely not. He, he might not even go down this game if he keeps playing the way that he played second stock. Mm -hmm. But oh. Haki. Ooh, he went for that nair side. Oh, oh that's a SD oh. for Haki. Unfortunate That's air dodge. That was a zero. Might have been a buffer, uh, yeah. But Rob's gonna take that first game. Grayson going up 1-0 against Haki. I feel. I think. Uh, I believe when he fought Haki in Oklahoma on Saturday, uh, Grayson did win from Grands 6-1. So really? yeah, Grayson is no stranger to fighting to Haki. He definitely. He definitely. Uh. He might not be out of this, especially if he turns up the heat like he did that second stock there. Oh, definitely. If he just plays like that, he keeps catching his mm -hmm. everything. And But Haki uh, was looking really comfortable in those games with King K. So if Haki can just apply that same matchup knowledge a little bit, just slightly alter it to Grayson's play style, he <laughs> definitely is not out of this yet. Yeah. And let's just hope that he avoids a lot more of those uh, like the SCs that we saw at the end of game one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and jumping around. That's another big thing, is that, like, just because ZSS's jump height, I think it's, like, the second highest in the game, and Rob's just, like, a short little stubby robot. She could just jump and jump around Rob, and there's... Yeah, really it's pretty much. hard for him to hit. His yeah. fastest aerial is forward air, but it's him... Ooh. Yeah, he yeah. got a little over Unfortunate up B. Like, I respect... That I respect oh, the, the footstool. Not quite gonna do it. He had a jump, but that was looking scary for a key down there. Ooh, Grayson will get really parry. comfortable, especially hitting these parries. Parry is... Oh! Stop Double. it! That was three parries now. He's looking really, really comfortable. Parrying... He's, he's call, yeah, he's calling out hockey on, like, everything parrying, he's doing out. Parrying is a mechanic that, when mastered, can get you so much mileage in this game, but that up, he's gonna catch him. Not yeah. the best DI there. Maybe he could've lived if he just DI'd a little bit more to the... Slightly. Yeah. Slightly up, I think. Nah. Maybe down. I don't think down right would have done. I don't know. I'm not going to this game. He, Whatever. 
<laughs> he's he's dead anyway, so yeah. on to the second stock. Uh, Haki, uh, down 100%, not undoable because as we've seen, Rob's, uh, it's really hard for Rob to pick ZSS mm -hmm. off his back, but Grayson, once he does, he's looking to make some real mileage off of this, uh, off the distance he makes. Down tilt, that's a move you don't really see much. On ZSS for sure. Yeah. That was a good catch on that down smash. Gonna take that second stock, only 50% extra credit to his name. Let's Looking see, really comfortable. Let's see if Hockey can do one of those uh, second stocks that Grayson did to Hockey last game. Mm -hmm. uh, and that'll definitely put him back into it uh, a lot more comfortably. It's good definitely parries not on these impossible. aerials though. ZSS's aerials are really safe on shield, but I feel like if you parry, that window for safeness just yeah, gets a little like that, so much, you can just have tilt. What? That was kind of a weird interaction, but Haki coming back with a parry of his own gonna I mean, be out. Not quite gonna do it. it. Ooh. Again, hitting all these back air parries. I, I think yeah. I feel like Haki just needs to find some other way. Maybe to change up the Haki's timing shield. on that. Oh, that's gonna take it. That DI Ooh. was not correct. Yeah. I will say that. That was definitely a DI time, mix up. He he caught it. Yeah, he caught him in the middle of flip jump. So he was already moving to the left. So. For sure. Grayson gonna take game two with two stocks left. He's looking That's... a lot more comfortable here. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, he's gonna really get up to turn up the heat. I think... Oh, we're gonna see oh. the switch to the link, okay. Yes, okay. So I love, love, love seeing uh, high level link. Cause like once I saw this character and how he got reworked in this game at E3 uh, 2018, I was like, this character's so much better. And I love seeing people just use like the bomb. Like that. I don't play like that. Mm -hmm. It's so much more, it's so inter interesting He's kind of cool. I think a lot, a lot of his normals are kind of lame. Like his forward air is dumb and his nair is dumb, but he's kind of cool. The bomb, I gotta say, is one of the coolest moves in Smash though. Oh, definitely. It's sick. And Hockey, definitely a really, really strong Link player. I w some would say world renowned. Uh, but Grayson, we're not, we have, I mean, uh, Jama, Hama comes here too and he plays Link, right? Yeah, Jama yeah. plays, uh, a lot Jama, of Link. okay. Hama, I'm gonna start calling him Hama. Jama does play Link, I've, though. I've uh, never heard his name pronounced. Oh, and the Bob recovery. I know Grayson has played Jama a couple of times. I think Haki is just a slightly better fundamental player than Jama, so that's where a lot of his results come from, and also a larger character pool. Unfortunate SD, Dang. like we saw earlier. But uh, Jamma definitely puts the fear of Link into DFW's heart. I'm not oh, even, uh, I'm not definitely. gonna shake a stick at Jamma. Jamma's a really good. Hama's really funny. I'm gonna start saying that now. Thank you for that. I, I, I feel so bad because no, I don't. Definitely did not That's hilarious. Uh, Grayson's gonna lose his second st or his first stock there. Looking really even though. Haki's definitely <laughs> looking a little more comfortable. Oh, the boomerang to up smash. That yeah. was nice. That up smash caught him. Up. Wow. He Look at is strange. He's not giving. Oh! Okay. That was close. I don't I don't know if that would have killed because I think it sends like horizontally, but that would have been pretty. Yeah, it would have been pretty attractive. He almost uh -oh. hit him with the Katy Perry, that young firework. <laughs> oh! oh! That was sick! All right, all right, okay, okay, Haki. All right, okay. calm down a little bit. Yeah, that was a little much. That was a little maybe excessive. not. You, you gotta make the comeback. That here. was clean. And I gotta just... say that was gyro to nair to f smash. For you. Yeah. And even even when Grayson grabs his own bomb, he's like, okay, I've already got that in mind too. Let me just grab you and get you out of here. Grayson's oh, really gonna look for these edge guards. That's uh, ooh, good back air. Yeah, gonna take so, it. So unfortunately, he didn't have the bomb uh, available with him to drop, so he couldn't bomb recovery. Uh, so he was kind of limited and linear in uh, how he could come back. Oh, and then if he had a shield, gonna take it. Yeah, that was really nice. That's a really strong move. Haki gonna take that game. That is uh, his first game to take, and he's looking a lot more comfortable in the uh, definitely in the link. Gray Grayson seems a lot more. Uh, like overwhelmed mm -hmm. with, especially since the, instead of uh, ZSS's potentially one projectile paralyzer, he's now getting boomerang in his face. He's getting some arrows. He's getting some bombs. There's a sword now. It's yeah, getting pretty all, rough. All the while, like Link's moving in on him because with uh -huh. ZSS per paralyzer, you gotta like stay in place to yep. shoot it. But you but can like boomerang. Move you can move independently yeah. for sure. It's looking pretty scary for Grayson if he can't make this adaptation. Yeah. 
I was gonna say, I think it's, I think Link in this game is so much fun to watch because he kind of reminds me of like how you play Breath of the Wild, and that you can literally like use all your different tools to do like. For sure, you want there's a lot of cre there's a lot of creativity, creativity. creativity. Yeah. All right, so running it back to Link. Uh, not surprised. Um, and we're going to. I, think I didn't back to PS2. see the stage pick. Oh, no, we are FD, on FD. final D. We're going to see if Grayson can get a little more comfortable in this matchup uh, versus Haki here. Yeah. And and the boomerang is really good because it's a, a longer okay, let's go box. Hockey. How do you say his name then if it's not Haki? I've only heard it say Haki. Whatever, I don't care. Going in again. It's looking pretty even here. Both of them just trading blows pretty much what's, what's even to the link? percent. How about that? Hey, yeah. Win the tournament, Link. <laughs> Win the video Not game. as exciting that way. Okay, well, uh... Link gotta come in with a 10% lead. See, that doesn't work. <laughs> Grayson's no. pulling it back a little bit. Oh... Oh, nice snipe. Is he gonna Bomb make it back? Recovery. Oh, he could have up smashed to catch it, and but I thought he was out. just... Yeah, I thought Lake. I also thought Lake was just gonna go a little bit lower than he did. I think that was good yeah. DI by Hockey, just to mix that up. Uh, that was that max range uh, F tilt, and that was super good catching uh, Grayson dropping a shield. I'm sorry, McB. I'll stop reading chat while commentating. <laughs> okay, uh, that was a nice up B by Hockey. It's a very quick move, so it's gonna be really uh, hard to do unsafe moves on shield without yeah or yeah. that air or that spot dodge. The wake up up B. Gonna catch it with a nair. I think I think Grayson uh, is seeing that hockey is uh, or hockey. I don't final. listen. Just say it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't care what they say anymore. Um, oh, that bomb! Not quite gonna take it. Like a lot of his stuff that he's approaching was kind of from the air. Yeah, yeah. caught him. Caught him sleeping. Uh, he's approaching a lot from the air, so was, I think he's playing a little bit more around that and hitting with a, a few more nairs and stuff. A uh huh. For sure. Aerials. See, he's just approaching with with the nair. I mean, that falling it's nair, it's yeah, it's huge. It's a it's really large move. So good. Down throw, up smash, though. Haki, uh, a little bit behind a percent, but nothing he can't rack up really quickly, especially with stuff like boomerang combos. Uh, Haki looks really, really, really comfortable with his character. Grayson, though, not looking quite as shaky as last game. Definitely, no. uh, he 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 figured sees. it out a little bit. Yeah. And again, that bomb is so good for Ooh, that just covering so many options. Spot dot jump smash, not quite gonna take it. Ooh, good combo. Nice. Again, nice. Really nice follow up there. And again, going up into the air to wear out the invincibility. Oh, is that Ooh, it? Oh, really nice I string. He wanted the side V follow up, but yeah. just, it got just broken out by Link Snare. We all felt it. Yeah. Felt it in our bones. Greg's gonna catch that roll out. That's not quite gonna. No, that's not gonna do it. No. I thought maybe it, it would send the uh, if he opposite way. It. There was a chance, but uh, I always sense the way that he's facing. Okay. Oh, and a good roll Ooh. read. Two okay. stocks left to Grayson's name. Got to reset the bracket here. Yeah. And hockey. I. Do you think he's gonna stick with the link? I think. I yes. think he might stick with the link. Just because it seems to be doing a lot better than his ZSS was. Mm -hmm. There's a lot uh, Also, a lot of that is that uh, Grayson, I feel like, is a little bit less versed on this matchup. Definitely, yeah. He, he's he got less time to set out and kind of like, you know, plant his feet. Or the Rob, for sure. Burn, Rob, I guess. fun fact, I'm so glad you said that. Rob is the only character in the entire game that doesn't have feet. I, Fun fact. I feel like that's so obvious, yet I'm still just yeah. amazed. You're just as amazed. Back into the game. Uh, Grayson opening up with these up air chains. Uh, Got to do a quick, clean 43%. He's looking to... Um, I think he's changing up. It seems like he can, on a whim, just change from hyper-aggression with strings to playing it passive, hitting you with a gyro or a laser. Yeah. It's just so well how well... It's so good how well he can change up his uh, playstyle on a whim. Yes, and Plant a, has feet. Check his running animation. And and I think another thing is that Hockey is is having to constantly adapt to that like shift in play style. Oh, uh, that's not quite. That's not gonna do it now. 
Another thing uh, that's worth pointing out is that when Lynx throw Boomerang, they like to throw it down angled quite a bit because that, that's going to take it out up smash out of shield. They like to throw it down angled. If Gyro is sitting on the stage, it blocks that Boomerang. So that uh, that's one approach option that's going to be a little harder for Link to just throw out there if that Gyro is blocking it. That string going to do a oh, that's yeah. 38%. Wow. It, it might serve him better to just hit it straight forward. Uh huh. It uh, might go over the. It might just still hit the Gyro. I'm not quite sure about that hitbox. But angling it up is just not ideal yeah, a lot and, of the time. Now Grace is catching up. Ooh, almost catching with that back air. Yeah, he's catching onto a whole bunch of his uh, defensive habits with mm -hmm. the air dodges of the rolls. But that side B on shield, not quite going to be safe. Going to get punished with that up tilt. Oh, and, you know, he he ran the other way. He he knew that it was going to send him into the soft tumble, but he the nice up the direction. Oh, try, he's... Did he extend the hitbox with the... I think Dyer? he did. I wow. think he did. That, that was, was pretty smart. nice. Oh, and deflect the bomb. Got to catch it. Both these players so confident. Ooh, the gyro to grab to... Uh, oh, no! He really He had tried. the gyro in his hand, so he couldn't do an immediate up air. That might have messed up his combo timing. And that was... I, I like the reverse up B, just in case... Because see... Oh, oh, didn't quite grab the ledge on that one. But if, if they Another get hit with a back hit, hit of a, a B, it'll actually push them in front of him, and then yes. you can set up for a good ledge situation. And you I think can, that's... You can reverse it when you're recovering and make it back and kill at, like, 80. It's insane. Oh, yeah. And and I think if he got him off stage with that, it would have... Uh, that That's where Hockey's really shining during this set, is, is uh -huh. when he gets the edge guards uh, in the bomb play. But Grayson is just... He's too oppressive on stage to let him get anything set up. Uh, set up. Hockey just, I feel like maybe a little shaky in this matchup, even if uh, he likes it more than the ZSS matchup. I'm not sure if he's 100% confident, and I think that might be reflecting a little bit in these yeah. SDs. It's unfortunate to say, but ooh, yeah. catching the drop shield with that F smash. And going Grace into game take, yeah, he's gonna take game five one. of the set. Well, game one of the reset, yeah. Game one of the reset. Uh, No, that this would be game six. You're right. Game one of the reset, one. though. Grayson yeah, he's taking take it, back it empty. pretty convincingly, it seems. Yes, you do see Bowser Jr.'s feet when he upbees. You're really adamant on proving this. Well, I mean, it's <laughs> obvious. The oh, only character you could maybe debate is Rosalina. Maybe, but I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, we see the snake. All right. We're having a third character switch. Uh, Grayson I, sticking to his guns. I, I I really like how with each character switch he's getting a little bit more and more defensive character mm -hmm. uh, wise. I think uh, even though Rob's, especially like Rob's laser is transcendent and it goes through other projectiles, it's still like slow. And especially when there's so many like grenades and stuff in your face, it's a little hard to get a laser like that out because grenades blow up pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. I, I like to think of grenades in this game as like a better Luigi Nair, where it's just it breaks any combo. Yeah, it does come out frame one, and if you hit that grenade while comboing, if your if your combo is not perfect, oh, nice catch that going back to the ledge. That was so smart. That was incredible. Grayson is playing out of his mind in this set. Definitely. Hockey really gonna have to turn up the character on this third character switch, or turn up the heat on this third character switch. The thing about character switching in sets is that it, as much as it might uh, throw off your opponent, it also breaks your own momentum. Like if you get into one mental state, like okay, I'm Link, I'm gonna throw Boomerang in this situation, and yeah. then you switch to Snake, it's gonna be a little harder to apply those things. But gonna take it with that Nikita off stage. Yeah, especially like, the difference between uh, like ZSS and Snake as well. Uh -huh. like, completely different. At least you have like a, a Link in the middle for kind of like transition. Because um, Link right. was a little bit, but yeah, I know what you mean. It's it's one of those things where, and, and then at the end of the set, you know, if you end up losing, it's like, you know, maybe if I had stayed that character, I would have done better. Uh -huh. uh, so it's just a whole bunch of variables that you're never really going to know the answer to. But I think uh, I think it's safe to say that I'm not going to fully question Hockey. He's a very smart guy, very smart oh, no. player, incredibly he's, smart player. That reason. better not kill. Why does that move kill so early? I was going to say, there's a reason he's uh, in Grants and we're not. So. Yeah, that's true. So, uh, Haki gonna go up this game for the first time in a bit that he's gonna go up a stock, but Grayson oh, clapping Grayson. right back. 10% yeah. on him, that's it. Looking very even here. And Rob pulling the, uh, the, the snake where he just goes up into the air uh -huh. and just drops stuff from below. I'm not sure how confident Grayson is in this matchup uh, specifically. I'm not sure how much experience he gets in it. <laughs> But the same could be said for Hockey, who I'm not sure how many times he's played Snake against Rob. 
Oh my god, there are so many explosions happening. And he's yeah. gonna take care of Troll. Oh, Rob yeah. has a really large hitbox, and the grenades even, and the C4, just the explosion the yeah. radius is massive. It's really hard to dodge stuff like that. So I think in this matchup, um, we were talking about earlier how ZSS with the gyro is pretty good, but it takes away all of her normals. Uh -huh. The thing with Snake is that uh, he doesn't really focus a lot on his normals oh, as much as he does with kill. his specials. That, that's true. But I don't know if he can pull a grenade when the gyro's out because it goes into his hand. That's true. It's another. I item. don't know. Who knows? Who knows? All we know is that it's game three. Gonna yeah. take game two of the reset. It's pretty convincingly there with that character switch. Yeah. So I feel like he's pretty. I feel like he's feeling it, starting to feel himself a little bit. Right, We're gonna but see we, if Grayson can hit a download. I, I want to say we said the same thing about like the wink. Uh, the game That's a good point. Wink. We did. So I, I think yeah. Grayson. I mean, he is a robot. He downloads pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. He's got that good. Uh, he's got that good download speed. The, like the the 200 megabits upload. Mm -hmm. He's got that fiber connection. Going on to town and city, uh, Grayson definitely wants a lot more space to run away from those explosions. FD, yeah. pretty cramped, so it's a little hard to run away from those grenades, especially given their size. But yeah, breaking out of those combos with uh, you, grenade pull. Safe. There it is again. Oh, so weird. At least it damages himself. If it didn't, I'd be pretty, pretty upset. Oh, he's going up. Grayson, that, ooh. This is so scary for both of them. <sighs> He's at 144 Cause percent too. Even if even if Grayson hit that up air, if Haki had managed to pull a grenade during that, Grayson might be dead. Cause that was so close to the top last Yeah. Time. I mean, I think in this situation it definitely would have been worth it because he's 150 mm -hmm. behind. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah. But uh that up throw's not gonna do it, no. Kind of said he's big in this game. Yeah, Snake never dies because he's heavy. They made him heavy because like, oh he's gonna be hurting himself the whole game. Why would he die early? It's stupid. I hate Snake. Whatever. Grayson's <laughs> gonna take this stock. That, that's on. just me being mad. I hate this. No, 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 no. Ooh, good spike. Gonna go for another one. Get air dodge through it though. Good stuff by uh Haki to recover there. And he's should he's, be able to take this stock uh, fairly crazy. early. Snake yeah. has really good kill power, especially if you can manage to hit something like a Nikita. Here it comes. Yep. Speaking of the devil, and I gotta hit it. He's just he's just trying to put out as many explosions as he possibly can mm -hmm. with two grenades, C4, Nikita, up smash. Like yeah, he's just trying to get as much stage control as possible, not giving it Rob much. But that Ooh. was he might have buffered an air dodge or something, but yeah, that was not optimal. That right. that air is gonna clap back and take that uh set, that first stock on Grayson though, whole stock behind. But uh, they can rack up damage really fast, so he's definitely not out of this. Definitely not. And. He could probably get like a little cheeky like C4 stick as well into a throw. Nikita, gonna chase him. Yeah, uh, Snake already building up 80 plus damage on uh, Rob going for that read on the down smash, not quite gonna hit. God, that Ooh. down smash is like very, very, very much budget uh, Falcon down smash. For sure. It's still a really good move, but I don't think it's quite as good as Falcon's, maybe. Falcon that kinda sucks in this game though. C4 I mean, recovery. He's better, but no. I don't know. Better than what? Smash four? Better than what he was before with the uh, with the. Update. Oh yeah, he did get boss. Yeah, his raptor boost is insane now. Why are we talking about this? Back to the I, match. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little off track there. And Akita gonna drop it. Uh, yeah. He is 132 right now. He's gonna Grayson fight definitely. Grayson definitely not playing in his face because he knows that one of the like an F tilt or an up tilt's gonna take this stock. So yeah, he's definitely gonna try and play. Ooh, he tried to go in on the lag on the on Nikita, but Nikita has no lag. I think it's really scary too because I think uh, he doesn't want to hit him too much with holding a grenade in his hand because that'll right. explode. And the higher up he is, you know, he's already 147 mm -hmm, for sure. Back throw. He's chasing yeah, him. Uh, yeah. It's so dumb. He, what I love he, it. What I love do? it. I hate it, but I love it. It's funny to watch. A bear not Got quite it. gonna take it there. Snake is very heavy, going for the really tall laser. He is in the sky. Uh, Snake fast fall down. air dodge back to stage is a really good option. Breaking out of the side B with grenade. The C4. Oh, all right. And suddenly Grayson on the edge. Ooh. Grenade again. He's so still 130 percent behind, but. Not undoable. I know. They're both like he's 130 percent ahead, and yeah. the weird thing is they're both theoretically oh. kill percent. Got to be really careful around his own grenades here. He's paying away. Uh, 
If he takes his eyes off of Rob, he gets hit by his own grenades. If, or if he takes his eyes off Rob, he gets hit by Rob stuff. But if he takes his eyes off grenades, he gets hit by the grenades. It's pretty, uh... Pretty scary stuff here in this matchup, but... Pucky not losing his cool, staying with his gun, sticking with those, uh, with the zoning. And I think it's working out for him. Ooh, that C4, oh. not quite gonna and this take is it. It's suddenly looking really scary. If he gets a good up tilt, good up tilt, good, uh, potentially good F smash, but that might, uh, that's yeah. it. Disappeared. Yep. Hockey's not his head, you know, like, you know, uh, yeah, I'm gonna it a little bit. That's fair. But, but that was really well played, that stock, Definitely. for sure. He took, I think, 30% or like 50% on that last stock while he racked Grayson up like mm -hmm. 140. For sure, Grayson though, gonna take game three of this reset. This is looking very doable for both players. Uh, looking a lot of, looking really comfortable with the snake here, but Grayson is showing that sticking with his guns is really working out that, mm -hmm. that like, just wealth of character knowledge that he has is really working out for him. I think a really good thing about this stage uh, for Snake, Lila, is, uh, the color of the stage in the background kind of makes it so that his C4s and stuff kind of blend in. That's true. It re it glows red for a second. I am yeah. of the firm belief that C4s should glow, glow red the entire time. Yeah. Because, like, I don't know if you've ever played Switch, like, played Smash on your Switch when it's undocked, like, you're just chilling. Oh, but if yeah, you fight a time. snake, invisible. You can't see his stuff at all. So you just <laughs> get exploded for randomly for no reason. It's so stupid. It's... Anyway. Uh, it's like game stage four. counter. It's an extra level to the stage counter pick. For sure. There is, uh, in the, the Sonic Lost World stage, uh, you can take it to, like, Battlefield or Final Destination form, and the grass on the front of the stage can hide stuff like Isabel Mine and uh, C4. It's so cheesy. That's that crazy. It's super cheesy. <laughs> All right, so Hockey, racking him up to 130. Yeah, for sure. He's got this down throw into grenade a lot, and that does a ton of damage, especially if he can manage to get a follow-up. But it seems like Grayson's not doing as good a job playing around these grenades, and I think that might be because uh, Hockey is opposed to just pulling as many grenades as he can whenever he can. He's pulling them a little more methodically, when he just when he needs them. Definitely. And, like... He's only Ooh. throwing them out when uh, it seems like Grace is throwing out like uh, an attack of his own. So like, he's kind of he's yeah, like a second shield. ago he threw at that grenade right as he knew Grayson was gonna down tilt. Exactly. So he got that that trade easily. Ooh, that raw side B. That yep, yeah, that's a guarantee past uh, certain percents. So the time that Snake can act out of him down throwing you is percent based. So after a certain percent, down throw to up tilt is a true combo. I was wondering about that. I didn't know yeah. if it was like longer for them to act out of the throw or if it's shorter for him to I'm act pretty out sure it's shorter for him to act out of it, but either way, okay. it is a true combo past certain percents and it will kill. Guaranteed. Definitely. It is the, a the super, super splits. strong move. I'm impressed if you look at the like the animation for him like putting his legs like straight up. Yeah, it's he's definitely got especially in a skin tight suit, like that's gonna hurt. For sure. I don't know. Anyways, so more importantly, yeah, this is looking pretty even. Uh, I think this stage is really, really working out for uh, Haki, but Grayson just showing Again. that he's not too afraid of those grenades. Oh, the gyro hit the grenade and bounced up, but it was still active because it had never hit Haki, so it still hit him. That's pretty, uh, pretty interesting interaction there. Ooh, trying to up air him through the stage, but the grenade canceling it. Down to ooh, oh, trying to go, try for, to the go for the F tilt. So I think that was really smart um, because if he tried to roll behind, I don't think he could have because of the way that hitboxes work in this game. Yeah, potentially. Yeah, Ooh, that after gonna do it. Wow, what do you see? Snake after a kill. But 159% definitely uh, still looking cl pretty much close to even. That's but that's ju but that's scary because uh, the longer Haki is alive, you know, the more damage he's gonna rack up with just those stray grenades, the stray explosions. But he's not gonna grenades. stop throwing up. Up throw. Yeah. Oh, not gonna go for the up throw. That's interesting. That up throw might have just taken that stock, so he wanted to go for the down throw, uh, just potentially to close it. But I, I think I'm up throw would have been the better option. I'm wondering if he like didn't mash on purpose to mess up the mix Grayson's up timing. for sure. Yeah. Mash mix ups are huge in this game. Especially with so many burying moves now. There are like, a lot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, and especially a lot of the ones, uh, burying got some mechanics changed as well. So, uh, burying pretty effective now. Especially on stuff like Game & Watch down smash and K. Rule down throw. 
stuff like that. Burying is a really strong mechanic that if you know how to make use of it, it's, it can get pretty frightening. Yeah, you go to any other game and you and you say like down smash or down throw to F smash is a true combo, they're gonna look at you crazy. But yeah, then you, you play K rule and it's like, oh, okay, that makes sense. Uh, anyways, oh, yeah. spot dodging through the first hit. Yeah. Second hit of F tilt's gonna take it. Game four going to Haki, and this is a game five situation in this yeah. reset. Game nine. Yeah, yeah. It's looking really scary. So, I was gonna say, um, I think it's really interesting uh, that he took him to Lila, and he was dropping a lot of grenades on the edge, mm -hmm. but the grenades actually were bouncing off because of the, right. sl uh, the slight the uh, tilt. Yeah. Projectiles, uh, they do some weird stuff on slants, for sure. Yeah. But, you know, it can be it can be beneficial. We're going to go to Final D for this Game 5. This is Grayson's counter pick. We're going to have to see if it works out for him or if Hickey's uh, third character switch, or second character switch, technically, uh, is going to work out for him yeah, to take this if, tournament. We'll see if third time's a charm. Go. Going back to Final Destination, another one where C4 is kind of hidden. Mm -hmm. Grabs a grenade and shields. Nice. One, and Grayson just kind of yeah, he's just floating being, around. He's yeah. not about to just sit on the ground where he can get exploded. He's taken to the skies, which is pretty smart. Snake's aerial game leaves a little bit to be desired. You know, oh, he doesn't right. have the best aerials. It's very like they're good at certain situations. But oh yeah, they're, they're very like one-sided aerials. So it's like yeah, for for what they do, they're very good at what they do. For sure, but, but they are definitely a, they are definitely not like a multi-tool aerial like Rob's forward air. Yeah. Boxing on a Rob is not easy in its own right, but on a character like Snake, it can get pretty difficult. Yeah. And so, again, on that, that, that mash mm, mix-up. Not mashing. But also, Grayson had to jump out there, because I don't know if you noticed, there was a grenade sitting right next to him. So That's he would have gotten hit by that. So he had to jump out of there, even if he wanted the follow-up. Ooh, out. trying to read that roll with that F smash. Ooh, nice oh. tech in place read. Not quite going to take it with that down smash, though. And he's taking Again, the Snake skies. is just so heavy. Ooh, catching with that F tilt. That was Ooh. interesting. He Nikita himself just to make sure he didn't get <laughs> to uh, get like dash or something. Yeah, for sure. just so Blaine like didn't get punished. Ooh, going deep for that edge guard, but that grenade's gonna say no. And and both of these, they are both living to massive oh, up tilt. And as soon as I say that, yeah. But obviously, one fifty one percent. Looking pretty grenades. scary for Haki here. And he's just laying grenades everywhere. He's limiting the amount of space that he can land on, and then using that to like guide where Grayson can land, and then punishing him based on his air movement. I think that's really smart with the grenades. Just such a good tool. Uh huh. That he should just get punished. What? At what percent? Oh, and Grayson. Grayson is not camp. happy about that one. He is. What, what was do? that? He was at like. I don't know if I saw that correctly. He was at like 40. 40? Yeah, like I thought he was definitely gonna be close to dying, but. Now I'm sad. <laughs> that was so dumb. That was, but hey man. You know what though? I'm not gonna count Grayson out yet. It's, it would be unfair to count Grayson out. Haki, he's, he's still got two stocks. We've seen him do this before. We've seen, I mean, yes. Stranger things that. have happened. Already racking up all that percent, but Haki's just not, just not shrugging in the face of danger here. What? Even with this lead, he's still playing very comfortably. Yeah, that. That Ooh, C4 beat. is on him. I think it, trans it transferred. Ooh. I saw it happen. He didn't see it. This is doable for Grayson. This is this so is close now, for both this is, players. This is game five. This is so scary. Gets the up tilt. Tilt. Not quite gonna take it. If Grayson manages to take the stock after that super early stock two, that'll be incredible. Yeah. That was. I like that. He used the Nikita and the grenade right there to just create a double uh -huh. uh, explosion. Just kind of furthering okay. Snake's oppressive wall. Grayson is playing so smart. Both of these players. Ooh, don't go up there again, Grayson! Don't go up there! Down throw. Try to get a read. Dash attack. Dash attack's not gonna quite Nikita. get. Ooh, canceling the analog on Nikita with a grenade. I'm not sure if that was intentional. Oh, back throw. This is going for an so edge guard. Doable. What is that? I can't see anything. Oh, this is scary. He really. This ledge trapping situation is really bad. This is. The, oh, is that that's it? gonna do it. No, no, oh, I missed. He's at 160. 
Oh, oh this, this is, is so this scary. Is so close. I have not commentated a set this close in maybe my whole life. This is Grayson. He's just he's staying back. He does not want to push his advantage. Yeah. He does not want to push. He's not. He doesn't anything. want to run in and risk getting up yeah. tilted, especially since that move is so good at catching anti airs. Oh, oh down throw. No. Up tilt That's gonna it. take it. Oh my heart. Be Ooh, still my was, beating heart. Well, that was way closer than we initially imagined it to be after that oh stop too. Oh my god. That was Wow. What a good, what a set for sure. Yeah. Good stuff to have. congratulations to to Hacky Hockey. Yeah, taking red line 128. Congratulations that's, for that's sure. Huge. Yeah. That was so such a good set by both players. A little it was a little rusty at first uh first mm -hmm. grand final set. He was trying to find his fo uh footing with what character he wanted to. And I think he definitely did with the bearded gentleman snake. Uh, he really ran away with that. I think Grayson a little less comfortable with that matchup and uh Hucky definitely got the download a little bit played mm -hmm. way more safe it got a little into Grayson's head um but definitely a super close set super fun to watch yeah and it was really good on Grayson last game to still keep his composure mm -hmm. and get that much he definitely off. kept his cool yeah all right well uh thank you guys for watching yeah this has uh, been redline 128 thank you again to our sponsor Marco's Pizza who doesn't like pizza if you don't like pizza I don't like you yeah that's not if, true if you don't like uh if you don't like pizza you're banned from the chat. Whoa. Sorry. I don't make the rules. Dang. That's... Uh, you heard it yeah. first. Thank you guys again for watching. This has been Redline Ultimate 128. It was fun yeah. commentating with you, man. I'll, I'll talk to you later. With you. Yeah.